everybody, Troy here. I had a viewer ask a question. They weren't 100% sure. But just to clarify, sometimes it's better on video than in typing it in the comments section. And plus, it uh, gives me content, helps out a viewer, plus, plus, win-win. How do I remove the back of the, uh, the trailer? He didn't know if it was he or she, if it was permanent or not. So uh, if it was two days ago and I was asked this question, it would have been much easier because I just loaded it with heavy metal yesterday evening uh, to go to the dump, to the scrap yard. And so, and I'm partially disabled, so I really don't want to pull everything out. It's really heavy. And so, but anyways, I can take the tailgate down for the viewer. And I'll just show you what I do with the sides. It's just a couple of uh, quick release pins. But uh, I'm just going to go ahead and set it up with the uh, mini tripod here and uh, do a quick video for you. I hope you enjoy it. Please uh, subscribe and all that good stuff. Just loaded it last night, yesterday evening, with uh, heavy metal down the bottom, scrap. I'm trying to clean up my yard. I was doing a little hobby welding on the side. And so I had a lot of scra scrap metal over there and stuff. But anyways, there I am going off, off topic again. I have a habit of doing that. But anyways, let's go ahead and uh, open up. It's just two latches. If you watch the uh, my assembly video and setup, it's all in there. I left the uh, quick pins out. I still got, I can uh, put the pins down here, but I left them out. So if I'm going to the shop or uh, taking my mower in, I can just uh, unhook those latches and the tailgate comes off. There you go. And if I didn't want somebody to take this off, steal something, roll something out, I can uh, put my pins in and put the uh, the keys in really quick. But that's it. Here we are on the side. Now the sides, I'll show you here in the shade. Uh, <clears throat> in fact, here's one of the uh, little uh, pins I put in. I'll have the uh, original video of me uh, putting this trailer together up above. But there it is. So if, uh, right now, they won't come off. They won't pop off. But all I have to do is uh, take this off. It's a little rusty right now. I need to oil them. Just pop that pin out. Pull the uh, homemade uh, key out the back on both sides here. And it goes all the way around. So if I want to turn this whole trailer into a flatbed... All I have to do is take all these pins out and I have a flatbed. I've never used a flatbed. I have a riding mower, which I'll show you. And I have some ramps. I can put my mower all the way in the trailer without having to take the, uh, the sides off. So I've never had to take the sides off or the front or the sides, just the tailgate. So and I'll show you my mower really quick. Uh, one thing I do is I bungee cord the, uh, the side of the uh, mower chute. So it stays up, so it doesn't uh, run into the uh, rail here. But that's pretty much it. Show you my John Deere just as proof. I've taken it a few times to uh, 45 miles away to the repair shop. All right, just to prove it, because this is YouTube, and a lot of people just love to uh, lie. There's my John Deere. I've had this since 2005. That is it. I hope you enjoy this video. Please give me a like, a sub. I'd appreciate it. Small channel. I like to help out viewers. Bye-bye-bye.